happy fall everyone and welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a fall outfits vlog because in my recent video a lot of you guys requested that i do more outfit inspos so here she is the weather in new york is still quite warm so even as i am wearing this sweater i am sweating but that's okay because we do it for the aesthetic anyways this is the first outfit of the day i'm wearing this really cute off the shoulder brown sweater from abritzia it makes me feel like a teddy bear i'm really getting into the autumn vibes for pants i cannot show you yet because i am actually still in my pjs but i am gonna get fully ready in a little bit to head out to run some errands before dinner but obviously just wanted to chat with you guys before we start this video and yeah let's get right into it changed now i'm heading out to drop off a package this is a little preview of the outfit going on a very short walk to the post office which is why i am able to wear these kitten heels these are actually from my mom from a very long time ago they're from steve madden I'll include all the outfit details in each clip but I wanted to talk a little bit more about these capris because they hit me at a perfect length and honestly that's not an easy task as a petite girl home from my quick errand run I feel like that was so quick I don't even know if you guys got the full outfit details but I wanted to show you the bag that I brought out this bag is from Paloma wool and I love the little bean shape. I also realized that I never really talked to you guys about my body type, especially for some of the girls who are trying to purchase the same items or are wondering what size I'm wearing. I am a very petite gal. I am 5'1 and have always been curvy, so I've done a lot of research to find pieces that is flattering on my body. And since we are focusing on fall, I really think that the most flattering neckline on me is a more wide neck neckline or an off shoulder sweater i will try to link most of the items down below if i can find them i will link them and if not i'll try to find an alternative for now i'm going to clean up a bit and then change into another outfit because i actually have a dinner date tonight we are going to a all you can eat omokase i don't know how i snatched that reservation but i snatched it so let's hope it's good and I'll make sure to look cute for it. Just got changed really quickly. And now we are on our way to dinner. Get to Sour Angie. pieces of sushi do you think I can eat? I'm gonna predict it right now and I'm gonna say 25. from Realization Par, I find these dresses very flattering on my body type and I was wearing my comfiest flats because I knew I was going to be walking a lot tonight. Good morning guys, we are starting our morning in this outfit. As you saw, I was relaxing in bed for a bit this morning and I also did already order food while I was in bed because I was craving Indian food. <laughs> Secured the Indian food. This place is called Chika Charcoal Grill. Okay. It's so yummy. Anyways, I'm gonna finish eating this 
and then I'm gonna get changed into my first outfit of the day and we're gonna head to Whole Foods because I have quite a bit of things I need to pick up. Changed, now we are on our way to Whole Foods. This one might be one of my favorite outfits because I feel like it's my autumn uniform. I love wearing a baggy edgy jacket with comfy jeans. The Smart Sherwood bag is a new favorite. I actually got it during their pop-up in New York. I love this color. I feel like it pairs so well with all the fall tones. Sneakers, these are my go-to Nike. They're so comfortable. And here I'm showing you this cute clip that I got from Ashley. <sighs> unloaded all the groceries and now I'm drinking a dog pop after our little grocery run I took a mini break did some editing and of course changed into another outfit and now we are on our way to dinner for tonight it's Gotham burger I've been craving a burger for the past couple of days so I'm excited also, Sour Aji from yesterday gave me a bit of a stomach ache, so I just want to go with the safe option. Wearing my favorite color for date night tonight, layering this sheer blue top from Mad Happy with this bolero jacket from Cos for extra warmth. I love how you can really see the baby blue from the back. As for bag, this is from Samo Ando. I love how the silver detailings match the Marc Jacobs shoes. made it to Gotham Burger. Yeah. Guys, I'm so stressed. Someone's replying to uh, everyone's comments for the giveaway saying that they won. It's a scam. Don't trust anybody. Don't give away your information, please. Anyways, I'm at Gotham Burger now. Ordered my double smash burger and some fries. Come on now. Over. Perfectly crispy, perfectly salted. Last bite, best bite. Good morning, guys. This is the first look for today, and today is going to be the last day where I show you guys my fall outfit inspos. I decided to throw on this trench because what is fall without a trench coat? The lip color that I'm wearing is this one from Rare Beauty. It is their lip stain in the shade Affection. I just think it's the perfect autumn color. Let me show you guys. Look okay. at Mm, the lighting just went away. It's like the perfect wine stain. Anyways, gonna head out for a bit and show you guys the first outfit and we'll go from there. I know that this trench coat desperately needs to be ironed, but I always bring it out for autumn because I just love the color and length. I also really wanted to highlight these boots from Dolce Vita because as a fellow Asian who has thick calves, I find these wide calf boots the comfiest.
I am now on my way to Kijitora because I have been craving their red bean matcha. Back at home after Kijitora, I'm just so tired, I don't know why but the red bean latte was delicious, very good. I would say that today, they kind of skimped out on the matcha on me. Now I'm just gonna relax for a bit before I meet up with Issa later to hang out. I think I'm just gonna watch a little bit of Shogun. Watching the clips from the Emmys got me curious. So yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a bit and then I'll get changed again to hang out with Issa. Guys, on my way and I brought a little treat, so hopefully she likes it. These are the cinnamon rolls. She's finally Emphasis trying. on the truth. I just beard pop at it. She definitely burnt it. Get into the fluff. Okay, I'm excited actually to see. Blind taste us. Blind, my God, how are you? Blind. Mmm. It's pretty good, huh? Ooh, look at the gooey frosting. The weather is still transitioning, so jorts still feel appropriate for the last outfit. I am pairing it with this Paloma wool top I got ages ago, but the color is so beautiful with this suede brown bag from Reformation. And I paired this with my favorite tan loafers, and that's it for the outfits. Walking home now, had a short and sweet hangout with Isa and Mei Mei. I'm so glad she enjoyed the cinnamon rolls. Now I am heading to dinner to meet my boyfriend. Decided to stop by home because I'm gonna throw on a jacket. It was getting a little windy outside. I actually got this off W Concept, which is a website that sells a lot of different Korean brands. This one is always my go-to once it's fall. And a little bit of lip gloss. And I'm ready to head out. Hi everyone, it is clearly the next day, but I wanted to finish off this fall lookbook and I hope that you guys found some inspo through this video. I love fashion, so I definitely want to incorporate more of these kind of videos on my channel. Please let me know down below which outfit was your favorite because I'm also really curious myself. I'm so excited for it to be fall. The weather is finally cooling down here in New York, so the sweaters can finally come out. I was definitely sweating a majority of this video from wearing all those outfits, but but it's worth it. That's it for now, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!